Senate Majority Leader Mitch McConnell's Louisville home was vandalized overnight, with the graffiti indicating a possible political motivation, according to reports. McConnell's Highlands home in Kentucky was discovered Saturday morning marked with angry messages, including Where's My Money? Mitch Kills Poor and Expletives. The graffiti could be seen in photos posted online. In a statement Saturday morning, McConnell condemned the act while reiterating his support for First Amendment rights. I've spent my career fighting for the First Amendment and defending peaceful protest, the statement read. I appreciate every Kentuckian who has engaged in the democratic process whether they agree with me or not. This is different, he continued. Vandalism and the politics of fear have no place in our society. My wife and I have never been intimidated by this toxic playbook. We just hope our neighbors in Louisville aren't too inconvenienced by this radical tantrum. The messages appear to reference McConnell's refusal to provide a vote on $2,000 stimulus checks after the House passed a measure earlier in the week. The Kentucky Republican Party moved quickly to support McConnell and condemn the actions, saying, vandalism is reprehensible and there's no place in our politics for acts like this. Kentuckians deserve better and the Democrats should join us in condemning this act of vandalism. The Senate adjourned Friday without any movement on the bill, meaning the next Congress will have to visit the possibility of any further aid related to the pandemic. Louisville Metro Police are investigating the McConnell incident, according to the Courier-Journal. The department could not be immediately reached for comment Saturday. 